We are standing next to a very rare vehicle. You know what color this car is? Um, hold on. Arctic white. Yeah, Arctic white, yes, Arctic white. <laughs> Another wide body yours build. The bumper is completely broken. We are standing in front of this Rolls-Royce Spectre 2024. As you guys already know, this is the third or fourth we've had here at RDB. We already took it to a car show. We already did one on 26 inch wheels. The beauty about this one is, is actually taken apart. Again, I don't know anybody that's taken apart a Rolls-Royce Spectre, but here you have the front end taken apart. The bumper is off the car. You see the radar sensor in the front. And then now you see this body trim right here. This trim used to be obviously a vent. This goes behind the grill and the engine gets cooled. Since there's no engine here anymore, no need for cooling there. So th there's this body colored trim behind the grill. The grill is pretty closed off anyway, so you barely see this, but I can see people painting this different colors. You also see these little dots all over it. These are actually stickers. These stickers are there right now because we have a company here 3D scanning all of the parts on this car for a potential body kit by 1016 Industries. We're gonna probably do a front lower lip, side skirts, rear trunk spoiler. We also took apart the side skirts and the rear of this car. A lot of the suspension, brakes, all those components are about the same as the old Rolls Royces, but um, you guys already know, this is the new electric version. Over here, we have the rear, uh, front bumper already, and I'm gonna show you guys what we did to it. Essentially, this customer brought the car on Monday. We took it apart and painted all the body black trims to the body color arctic white so if you guys know specter this was white and this whole bottom lip right here was black before it is now painted arctic white it's gonna look so much more bigger and bodied out when it's all painted white so I have rdb 14m brand new designed wheels for this car so we're gonna lower it as well again this is the first in the world with wheels we did it and now this is gonna be the first with paint work and wheels and really modified in the world as well. So keep watching. This is the Pagani Waira Roadster. This top comes off, comes the Roadster. It's not the regular coupe, so even more rare. We wrapped this Pagani several months ago. Uh, owner wanted to just have it matte black for a little bit. Didn't even drive it, to be honest, and uh, wants to go back to original now, which is this beautiful pearl white, and it has a few red stripes around, so it's pearl white, exposed carbon fiber, and red. Interior is also black and red, full of big twill carbon fiber. We had Pagani meticulously take off a few parts so we could wrap it. We did it that way as opposed to us taking it apart just so we don't have any you know, drama or headaches, so it was all done the right way. Pagani's gonna come out again and take off a few little things so we could take the wrap off. But for now, as you can see, we removed some of it and uh, it looks a little funky now. You've probably never seen a Pagani like this. So this car is worth over $3 million and um, it's crazy. Let me show you the engine bay. Hank, can you come help me? I mean, look at all the gold hardware. Look at the suspension, carbon fiber everywhere. Look at the reinforcement, chassis bars, all that stuff. Look at the exhaust system, titanium from Pagani. This is a crazy car. Scared to drive it. Basically, we just took it once around the block and back to make sure everything is good. And uh, it was. So the car went back and um, now it's back to take the wrap off, like I said. So we're truly excited that we were able to work on cars like this because this is like a work of art. It's not really even a car. It's like, it's an art piece. So there you have it. Pagani Waira Roadster at RDB. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine this is your key. It is big, like you can't put it in your pocket. I mean, it's flat though. That's cool, my kid would break it. Here we have the Pagani Waira key. As you can see, it is shaped like the car, it has lock, unlock. And um, believe it or not, you could take this off so it could be manual. This is, if it's familiar to you guys, this is actually like a Mercedes key. So Pagani uses um, different components from different manufacturers that are well-established, like Mercedes-Benz. Uh, okay. 
this and the reflector i'll do it hold it where's the f oh. how the f am i supposed to reach that so what do you think about the paint so <laughs> how like much for that hoodie and you dirtied it already no i didn't you're the only one that's ever worn this no yes i think i think the two um what do you call that paint hey, cow fire. so what do you think about the paint why are you here? Did he tell you to do something? What do you think about the paint job? <laughs> what? It's it's great. What, what do you want me to say? So the bar shop did an awesome job, huh? With my management. You have nothing to do with them painting this. See, that was bar shop. Do you know only. what color this car is? <laughs> yeah, white. What is it? What's the name of the color? Uh, white. White? Yeah. So they just call it white from yeah. factories? No, no. Oh, you mean white? the paint code? I'm not talking about the code, but the name of the paint color. Um, hold on. Was, was it, 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 the word is no the word is hard, hard to remember. It's not. It's actually a very easy word to remember. Yeah, yeah I already know. I know. Very super. Yeah? He even knows okay, it. Tell me. Yeah. Tell what me. is it? So you don't know it? Admit you don't know it. So okay, you're the body shop guy that did it, but you don't know the paint. Code. Okay, I admit I don't remember. Arctic white. Yeah, Arctic white. Yes, Arctic. <laughs> wow. But I can't remember that word. Art, art, art. You didn't even know. That's what do you mean remember? You never knew. Because you have so, nothing to do with anybody. So you like it? But but did you notice the car is like... Yeah, yeah, because one side he has more blocks. Oh, okay. Let me help you so the bar ship can help. No, man, get out of here. <laughs> oh, you're going really far your side. Yeah. Malik. Left, 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 left. Left, left, more. Right there. Okay. Uh, okay. Good, good, good. Man, that's yeah. so much it's a BMW, that's right. <laughs> so much it's nicer. easy to make. The whole entire piece was black. Uh, so, so this way it looks like a body it's white, camera. white, white, instead of white, white, and black. So, on the black car, this was black, but actually a different color than the body color, and you guys didn't notice it because all black. But on the white, this, this black is significant, and painting it to the body color is the way to go. That looks so much better. Customer opted to leave some chrome trims. You could have painted that too, but he wanted to have some chrome and white. We even painted the reflectors I think he's white, with and the they lights. used to be obviously orange and red. So lights are chrome. So try to match it. All the lights. All the parking sensors were also painted white because they used to be black. Oh, so those were also painted too. white. This is uh, the reflector that's gonna go pretty much there. It goes from the back, tapes on. Painted that as well as you can see. So yeah, little changes but it's gonna make the world of difference. And of course, the new RDB wheels going on this thing is gonna set off the Spectre oh, world again, just like we did with the black one. It looks like a whole different car. It looks like a car has a body kit on it. If you pay attention, it looks That's like a body point. kit. Now, the, the Spectre actually looks like it has a body kit, but you don't see it because it's yeah. black. So, now that it has the paint white, it looks like there's a kit. So I can only imagine later on when we add a kit to it, how So everyone wears a uh, Spectra, just bring it. Spectra? Yeah. <laughs> Spectra, no? You don't know the paint code color. You don't know the name of the car. Spectra, no? You stole my hoodie. <laughs> Fuck. Spectra. Joe barely makes a video a week now. Okay. Okay, so who has the Spectra? Bring the car. Said it wrong again. Spectra. Okay, what's the name then? So who has the Spectre? Bring the car. We'll paint it and it's going to look like a body kit. So this way, the car is more expensive, has a more expensive look, and it looks like something that is crazy. Do you get commission if they no. bring it? Oh. No, no, fuck it, don't bring it. Peaking this year, so we're not. What are we doing here? We are also trying to button up another wide body years build. This is a beautiful one. As you can see, it is satin pro white. It kind of resembles my car because of the theme. Back in the day, the first wrap I ever did on my Urus was a satin brushed white. So this satin pro white is really, really nice. And it's got the full 1016 industries carbon fiber kit on there. No expense spared, has every part on it. Uh, we even have the side skirt extensions. 
These are the new wingtips. Just this is actually carbon copy of the Performante wingtips that go on the 1016 roof spoiler. So you get that added uh, width to the roof spoiler. I actually need that for my car. So 1016 is gonna make that. But regular carbon fiber and the really, really crazy part, the revolver RDB wheels, three piece, super concave, ridiculously concave. And it's got those circles obviously in the middle, 24 inch and the RDB stance that nobody can replicate. We're the only ones that can get it as aggressive, as low. This is not even in low mode, this is in regular mode. Without rubbing with day-to-day -day driving, tested on my car for four years already. Um, we are the experts of stance. If you want the right stance on your wide body cars, you come to RDB. When you do wide body on a car and your stance is not right, you're wasting all that money on looking goofy. So make sure to go to the right place. Let me put it in sport mode. So there you have it, it's going down. We're gonna adjust it and probably go a little bit more, probably another half an inch, so we could barely put our hands in there. This customer wants the fitment sort of like mine, so we're gonna make it more aggressive for him. I know the Cayman got a lot of good press, people loved it, we're getting a lot of inquiries from older Cayman cars. Uh, but here we have the front bumper back off the car. As you can see, the bumper is completely broken. It's cracked on the top of it, so it's got a little crack over here because it kind of pushed in. And it went in and it hit that radiator and actually broke it. So we're gonna go ahead and change this as well and fix that bumper. Here's actually the new radiator. Here's the old, the two radiators go here. But as you can see, this got smashed right here. It goes like this. And now we got the new one already that's gonna go back in its place, so. That wasn't hard to get. No, this was pretty easy to get. Easy, easy rated to get. It's an older, older car, so uh, not very hard to get mechanical parts. All right. Dad. All right, so you guys should be familiar with this design. Uh, this is a repeat customer that we have here. I don't know if you guys remember, a few years ago we did his Jeep Wrangler. You guys will probably remember his logo, which is a snake logo. And it's a two-tone wrap, so we did the same thing with the new Maybach that he has, same concept. But this one's a little unique, it's a little different than the Wrangler. Uh, you guys can see different designs, basically from purple fading into white, going back to purple. Door jams as well, and that crazy snake picture right there that you guys see on the door is also wild. Let's take a look at the uh, door jams. So the door jams are done in one piece, you guys. One piece, you guys cannot, there's no lines, no creases, nothing. Beautiful. So when you open a door, it's the same theme you have as the exterior of the body of the car. So that's what he wanted, we made it happen. We also have the uh, Maybach emblems that light up. We did that as well. So everything came out perfect on this car. Customer's here to pick it up. This bad boy is going to Las Vegas, Nevada. And he's gonna drive it there. So that's about it. Does anybody know what makes a food organic? Everything is natural. Food. Natural water, natural everything. That's I think organic is a There's camera. artificial water? <coughs> yes. Okay. From the ocean. Okay, I'm done. Fuck. All right. No, bro, you this guys. This is my last episode. Ah! Hey! Don't forget to subscribe and like the video.